me there. So first up, follow up from last week. Um, last week I demoed full 360 degree turns with the trichatra with my left hand performing flower. And uh, it's not entirely stable just yet, but I've got the right hand most of the way there. So, um, interesting challenge I got from Insignia based upon the last one. Um, as I was uh, demoing this variation where you're essentially doing a trichatra pointed up on top and a trichatra pointed down on bottom, uh, Insignia came up with a rather nifty challenge of doing both of these inside essentially the same area so that a horizontal float takes you between them like so. So, whoops. As you can see, it's not so difficult to pull off. Provided you're thinking about it. So, this has been fun. Um, doing this actually gave me a really interesting idea of uh, trying an inverse of this pattern that I've been playing around with for the past couple weeks, wherein you're switching between top and bottom trichatras. What if instead of having um, a point going up and a point going down, they met together in the middle, in which case you got a triangle up here pointing down, and a triangle down here pointing up. Now this ain't remotely clean yet, but essentially, oops, it results in a pattern that looks something like this, which truly is a figure eight consisting of linear extensions. It's difficult to keep stable though because when you drop down, oh, that's not bad. So yeah, uh, that's been an interesting experiment. And aside from that, um, so there is a Vulcan tech blog with a young lady doing kind of club spinning where she folds the clubs inside her arms like this and turns with it. I've been trying to come up with something similar to do with poi, but uh, it's proving difficult. Not the least of which, because there's gravity involved. But playing around with it took me to a really interesting place I wasn't expecting to, wherein there's an interesting transition from an anti-spin butterfly flower to a hybrid weave, like so. Where you stop up here, stalling, and then you bring the other hand around. Which is cool because I've been trying to find ways in and out of hybrids because they don't seem to play well with many other shapes. Or so it appears. So, stone and around. And stone. So yeah, aside from that, I've just been, uh, been working more on turning with these anti-spin flowers from the butterfly pattern. And the motion's getting at least a little bit more smooth. Oh, blah, blah.
lot of these past this past week. So uh, yeah, thank you for watching, guys. Hopefully, uh, this stokes a lot of conversation. And uh, there's one other dude who challenged me with doing essentially um, stalls in the middle part of this type of flower. And I'm not there yet, but give me time with it. So it'd be like on the inside arm like that. And then you pull out of it. Like so. But yeah. Give me time with it. Anyways, thanks for watching guys.